on your radar. So this week, the students at Yeshivat Noam in Paramus, New Jersey, celebrated their graduation. But like many students across the nation, their ceremony was canceled because of COVID-19. However, Rabbi Chaim Hagler is the head of the school. He surprised his students by bringing graduation to each one of his 86 eighth graders. Take a look at what he did. <laughs> Volunteers, Hanan Vogel. He uh, created the whole idea. He choreographed the entire graduation. He was the visionary and then worked with an amazing team at Stelzer and Ari Wartelsky to put the entire thing together. One of the people, uh, one of the moms reached out to me, Shira, and she said, You have to see this video. She just wanted to put a smile on my face. And then I showed it to my producers, and I'm like, I think we have to do something. I think we all need a smile on our faces. How long did it take you to do this graduation ceremony? Because you went to 86 houses in Paramus. It took two full days, uh, all day Sunday, all day Monday, about 10 hours, 11 hours on the float, but it, it was incredible. So what was the reaction from the kids? Because some of them seemed stunned. They didn't know what to expect. They didn't. Um, we had sent out a letter to the parents letting them know that we're coming around. We didn't tell them it was going to be a float. Uh, we asked them to please have the family waiting outside on the lawn with chairs and have the graduate in cap and gown waiting inside their house. So when the float pulled up, um, one of our administrators knocked on the door and called the graduate out. And that was the first time they saw the float. Uh, they were in shock. I know. It, you could tell by the expression on their face. So we saw the video. It looked like everything went swimmingly. But were there, were there any hiccups? Did you have any challenges in putting this together? Um, there were a lot of challenges that the team had in putting it together, working out all of the logistics, but they pulled it through. The biggest challenge that we faced um, over the two days was my voice. <laughs> uh, as the day went on on Sunday, I was starting to lose my voice, but we got through that as well. So let me ask you, how did the school year go? Uh, you did remote learning, I'm assuming. Uh, will there be summer school? We're not planning to have summer school. We really feel like the, the, the students need a break. Uh, there's a little Zoom fatigue going on. Uh, we want them to have some fun. Hopefully they'll have a great summer and then we'll come back strong at the end of the summer. Are, are you planning on doing uh, in-school teaching when you come back? That's our hope. We're waiting to hear the guidelines from the state of New Jersey, from the borough of Paramus. Um, once we get that, we'll know for sure, but it's certainly our hope to be back in school and uh, with the students in person. By the way, Rabbi, you have some great dance moves. I'm just wondering, have the students seen that before, you know, the graduation? Uh, we, yeah, we dance at different times throughout the year, you know. Uh, there are definitely times throughout the year, so they've seen some of them, but uh, this was special. The, the, the atmosphere, uh, the energy, was, was just magical and uh, we were all dancing. I'll tell you a great thing is we were riding down the street and total strangers heard the music and they started dancing. I just felt like people have been cooped up for so long that they just wanted to dance. I, I imagine everybody in the community must have loved this. It must have been a great sight to see. I'm just wondering, Rabbi Hagler, if people now reaching out to you, uh, do you do weddings, bar mitzvahs on the float? Uh, what, else, what else are you up for? 
that you know that is so true. We we a number of people did reach out to us how they can borrow rent. Uh, the float for various different things, um, but we've been hearing from people literally across the world uh, about this event. Well, congratulations to the kids at your school, and Rabbi, uh, thank you so much for coming on Good Day New York and, and spreading some cheer this morning. That's what it was all about, it was about spreading the cheer and bringing the cheer to the students and sharing them up, their families, and uh, wow, we, we were just so thrilled that it went beyond that and brought a smile to so many people's uh, faces. All the best. Shabbat Shalom. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, coming up on Good Day.